So here we are, we're at Reg King, it's uh, July 28th, 2011, and uh, we got our nose pumps all installed, and they're all primed, all full of water. So as you can see, cattle comp against them, push in, fills up in the back again, and that's the watering system. It comes from Smith Creek, out behind, from the hoses, we'll show you after. We got it mounted here on 6x6 six six posts, they're 5 feet long, about 3 feet in the ground. Mounted on six six by six rails. These are about 17 feet long. We have them spaced at about I think we go about to almost two feet on average, about well maybe 18 inches. And uh, then we run 50 feet of line out into the Smith Creek, which we can show you here in a minute. All right, so here we are at the at the bank. Um, now what we run is the six hoses from each pump, each individual pump. They're about half inches in inner diameter. Each one runs out into Smith Creek. Now before we installed this, Ben had to go through the, the water, land and water course alteration permit to get these installed and make sure we can do our work along here as we're working here. So that was part of the application process. We worked on behalf of the landowner here. Um, what we ran is basically, like I said, the six inch, uh, the half inch hoses, the six of them, out into the, the middle of the, uh, of the Smith Creek here. And each one of them have a small filter on the end of the hose and a foot valve. Now the foot valve allows for the suction of the water, but it doesn't allow it to, to go back, so it always keeps its prime. What we have out sitting out there, they're collected into a bunch of sticks, and we put them into, into a, a corrugated uh, plastic box. We, we put them together with some wire and keeps them off the bottom, and keeps them weighted down so they stay underwater. And from there, they'll suck up, and they work as I showed you earlier.